Hello. I'm Ava. I've been created by people living with lung disease working with researchers at the University of Sheffield to help people manage their health. My creators understand that it can be hard to manage your health on your own. All of us need help sometimes. Of course, you can always go to the doctors or see your specialist nurse. But I'm here for the times when you can't get to see them or maybe don't feel that you need that level of support. I'm here any time of the day, any day of the week, all year. That's my job. I've been programmed with general information about health and well-being, but the more we talk to each other, the more I can learn about you and your needs, the more I can help. If you are struggling I can motivate you. I can assist in an emergency, or I can simply help you learn more about your condition. And I have a perfect memory, so I am really good at remembering things and helping you learn from experience. But guess what? I'm not a human. I know it's shocking, but it's true. I'm a robot. I'm not a real doctor and although I am quite smart I can't really understand your problems, at least not like a real person can. So I can't replace your GP or the emergency services. You could think of me as an understanding and informed friend. I've been developed as a health tool, so if you let me I could act as a go-between with your doctor, but ultimately you are in control. I'm now going to give you two examples of how I could help. Allow me to introduce Terry. Terry is a good friend of mine. He has been living with COPD for over 20 years. He manages his condition very well. He eats healthily, he exercises, regularly socializes with his friends and manages his medications well. Yet there are still times when he needs some extra support. Hi Terry, how are you today? Oh, hello. I'm not too good today. Can you tell me a little more? Well, I'm feeling tired and I've got a chest infection. It disturbed my sleep. I see. Do you want to talk about this with me? If you can help me, of course I do. Great, I'm a good listener. What's going on with you? <coughs> well, as you can tell, I'm having a bit of a cough and it's uh, interrupting my sleep and the breathing's not been too good, which usually happens when I have a chest infection. Yes, I can see that the air quality in your bedroom hasn't been great the past few days. I'm noticing the humidity is quite high too. Are you on top of your medications? Inhalers? I am indeed. I make sure of that. That's great. It's important to make that a priority but not always easy to remember. Okay. What have you been up to the past few days? Very little. I've just been trying to get from one day to the next and get myself right again. Have you seen any of your friends or family? I haven't seen any, but I've spoken to one or two on the phone. I see. Do you enjoy socialising? Well, I like to get together with people at the Breathe Easy meetings and such forth, but at the moment I don't feel like it. Have you been feeling like this for long? Just the past few days. OK, Terry. I hear that you enjoy seeing your friends and I know that when you do you feel better. Maybe seeing them won't instantly help your breathing but it can certainly pick up your spirits. Agree. My calendar shows me that there is a singing group on at the leisure centre. Why don't you go? We'll see how it goes on the day. I'd like to go. It's up to you to decide what you want to do and how you want to do it. What makes sense to you right now? I think you're right, and I do need to get out. 
Would you like to make a plan with me now to try and increase the chances of you making that positive step on Wednesday and attending the singing group? Yes, I'd like to try. The singing will also really help with your breathing regulation and strengthen your lungs. So firstly, how would you get to the group? I think I would get a lift. With young Tom. Great. Shall we call Tom now to arrange that? Yes, call Tom, please. This is great, Terry. No one feels up for things all the time. But I know that once you get into a routine with this, it will get easier. Thank you, Ava. <coughs> Hi, Terry. Are you okay? <coughs> Just checking you're okay. <sighs> Do you need me? <sighs> I need something. <sighs> I need some help, please. I can't breathe. I'm here. Have you tried your inhaler? I used it just a few minutes ago. Breathe in gently through your nose and breathe out through your nose and mouth. I'll do it with you. How are you doing? A bit better, but I think you should call my daughter, please. Call my daughter, Jenny. OK, I can call for help. <coughs> I'm calling her now. Thank you. I'm putting you through now. <coughs> 